She's just trying to help. Is it doing? What it's supposed to. Oh yeah. That's wonderful. <laughs> that is beautiful. I need to go deep. <laughs> put that piece of insulation over it and then if we ever run into problems we'll figure it we'll know why then we'll figure it out. <laughs> we'll know why. Do you have something heavy I can use? Um cool. Just 
that. Okay, well I stepped in it, so let's go. So, Austin went to work, and he told me that to be set up for success, I should take the cup holders out while he's gone. So, that's what I'm going to attempt to do right now. How well it's going to go? Well, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, I got these open. Not even the right one. Let's try this one. Alrighty. So I guess step one would be to find the right bit for these cup holders. Maybe I should take all the garbage out of the cup holders first. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna get one of those. Right, right. These are made for this stuff, right? Sure. And these have all our screws in them. Put that in somewhere. He ripped this out of the wall earlier, too. Here's some, whoop, not today. Some of it's in English, but pretty sure it's old as fuck. confused. I'm gonna pause this. See how this goes. So our goal tomorrow it's going to be to try and build our bed. How well that's going to go, we'll find out tomorrow. I would like to point out that two pieces of plywood, three quarter inch, was $200 for two pieces of plywood. Ridiculous. Well, moment of truth. Alright. Well. We never really discussed whether or not we were wanting to keep these lights, but I'm assuming not. So. Just disconnect that. One. 
I did it. Lemon squeezy. Okie dokie. Alright. Well. Show you what's going on inside. Boop, boop, boop. So. Got some wiring. Got some insulation. We want to help. hopefully build a bed going our heads in the window and then our feet in the other window and we'll just be smushed together. It's fine, right? I think so. Nice and cozy and warm. And then we're going to do the kitchen here. And we want to see how there's, it's like hollow in here. There's all that space. We want to cut here and over there, right? And make more room for our cabinet space and then that was a little fuse box in here that was our little fuse box right there so we're gonna just incorporate that into our kitchen cabinets and hopefully that works out we'll just have like a little spot here for our fuse put a piece of plywood down behind there since we already put this piece down and we didn't realize that there's so much space behind there and then tomorrow is the bed hopefully we'll see how that goes we'll keep it posted also this is our flooring right now we were going to try and use the bolts that had been in here for the bed that was already in here, like the seats. When they were in here, they were bolted all the way through to the bottom of like the van. So there was bolts all throughout here. And we were going to try and just bolt this down to have it be sturdy and all that good stuff but clearly that did not go as planned so we just used some spray foam as you can see it peeking through there and we just did that instead and honestly it's pretty sturdy i'd say we're obviously gonna have to fix a couple things but you know what? We're not professionals. We're just here for a good time. And we'll have to do some trim here and there. Obviously it's not looking great, but hopefully by tomorrow it'll be a whole new situation.